This is a clean, simple colorway. We've seen colors like this before, and it just works. It just works. <laughs> Hello, 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 and welcome to another episode of Quick Scopes. Today we have the Air Force One chocolate, and this pair is in chocolate white. Let me take this opportunity to ask you to like, leave your thoughts, subscribe, ring that notification bell so you don't miss a video. Ah, uh, yeah, purchase links for these in the description. Stay tuned for the on foot. So, yeah. Let's start from the soles up. So we have a chocolate outsole. We have a white midsole, midsole stitch, Nike Air and Strip. And then we come to this upper. So this upper is composed of a very lovely chocolate leather. And if we start from around the toe, you'll see that we have chocolate around the toe and on the toe box. I'll be saying chocolate a lot in this um, review rather than brown. It's such a nice hue. This is a good one, in my opinion. And the leather is pretty nice as well. Going up the shoe, you'll see that we have this chocolate leather around the eye stay. And at the base of the eye stay, we have a white mini swoosh. This eye stay is reminiscent of the old school Air Force Ones. You can tell by the cut and the taper at the base. Very, very nice. Above this, we have some white laces to the thickness that I like. These white laces conceal a chocolate nylon tongue. And at the top of this tongue, you'll see that we have a chocolate tongue tab with the white Nike Air. Taking a look at the mid portion of the shoe, you'll see that the mid panel again is in that chocolate smooth grain leather. And then we come to the swoosh. So the swoosh is a white leather swoosh, as you can see. The quality of it is similar to the upper. I think it's a little bit more better in my opinion. And yeah, pretty good, pretty standard, pretty normal. The foxing, however, returns to that chocolate goodness. And then we come to the heel of the shoe where you'll see that we have chocolate again for the heel panel and we have the Nike Air in block capitals. No swoosh present here. If we take a look inside the shoe, you'll see that we have a chocolate sock liner which matches the chocolate insole and we have white for the Nike Air. Let me know what you think of this pair. For me, good. These are pretty good. This is a clean, simple colorway. We've seen colors like this before and it just works. It just works. White detailing on a mainly colored upper always, always works. Whether it be red, blue, yellow, whatever it is, as long as there's a white midsole, white swoosh, white laces, it just works perfectly. And yeah, this one just goes well. The chocolate upper is really, really nice. Nice to the touch. Um, it's a nice hue of brown on this one. It's not too dark, um, it's not too light. It does look like chocolate, maybe a darker kind of chocolate, but yeah, it's pretty good. This pair does bear a lot of resemblance to the color of the month, but it is not listed as a color of the month. Similar to the red pair, which I had um, queries about, if you remember, um, check out that review. Um, the leather is similar, the build of the shoe is similar, the Nike Air, again, is similar, but you do not get the accessories. So there's no toothbrush, no paper, nothing like that, no little booklet. So it's not a color of the month and it's not listed as one on the Nike website. So as for the laces, white laces with this one, perfect for this pair, obviously matching the swoosh and the mud guard and other details as I previously said. You could swap them out to a, another brown lace. So to match the upper, to match the chocolate upper, it would work. Um, as for other laces, I'm not too sure. Orange, maybe? Something different? I'm not too sure. I'm not really 100% what I'd swap them out to. So let me know your thoughts if you would swap these out and what you'd swap them out to. Remember, these are the only laces that come with this pair. So if you want to do a lace swap, you have to do so from your lace box. Let's check these out on feet.
with all that being said, solid colorway in my opinion, and that's why I give these a 7.5 out of 10. Great leather, great color, safe blocking. Nothing too adventurous here, it just works. Let me know your thoughts on how do these compare to the red pair, another pair of sort of color of the month. Um, purchase links to the color of the months, to these, everything in the description. I've been Scopes, signing out. See ya!